other thing I was talking about the other day. A universal flow or a universal creative flow. It's like this connection between everything. And some people know about it, some people don't. It's just like this, um, well, it's not really a connection, it's an understanding of things. Like, many, there's a lot of people that only understand their way or their way in a couple of ways. Or like, do you know what I mean? Like, they understand only one situation. But a lot of people understand a lot of situations, or some people understand more than others. But anyways, a lot of struggles and stuff is what makes you have a more understanding. I mean, you can, someone, you could hear about it or something, but you're not going to understand it as much as if you experience, or you know, experience different situations, they're different, um, struggles. I was saying, like, certain artists, you know, that can include musicians, actors, artists, dancers, you know, there's all kinds of fields of art. Anyway, there's also, you know, some people do it as a business type thing, and some people do it as a career, or, they're both careers, but some people, it's like, more small time, and some people, it's, you know, like, famous, big time, or some people do it as a hobby. But anyway, the creative flow, or the universal creative flow, I was saying, like, famous, um, artists, or, you know, that kind of career, they use it to their advantage, or the understanding or the struggles like put forth through their or got to to where they are or not all you know what I mean it's like you earn the more struggles and the more stuff you go through the more you get to a place or, I mean, part of it's your skill, but part of it's also what you go through in life. Some of the artists I was saying is Lil Wayne or Wheezy, Michael Jackson, Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga isn't as great, or, I mean, I'm a fan of hers, but, like, She's not as big as Lil Wayne and Michael Jackson. Or a lot of her. Or, you know, I, well, I haven't been listening to her as many years. But all these artists use that. It's a creative flow on all levels. If you know, a lot of artists will do a song that's like on a different level, or like you know what I mean. But then there's like great artists that can do it on all levels, or do you know what I mean. Most artists, their songs will be no, that's not. Well, a lot of artists step. Some artists step further out of bounds of what's accepted than others, and that, you know, they create something. But 
some artist can create a universal connection or flow through their music, or like, you know what I mean? I think that's why I, I like those artists better, like, will I identify with them more? No, I understand all artists, but they, once you understand this universal flow, or if you have that, it's like, They own it, if you know what I mean. Or they use it. They, they have the um, skill to use that universal flow. Or universal creative flow. A lot of people understand that and might even have it and might be able to use it but they don't own it like or you know what I'm it's like an understanding of I don't know if it's levels it can be levels or worlds It's like summing up life in their music, but a lot of artists do that. But sometimes it's more their life than their life in an understanding of life, of all life. I feel more like understanding life when you, you know what I mean, a lot of people, but you have to use it, or own it, or like, do you know what I mean, it's hard to explain, or like, like you're um, not connected if you know what I mean it's like you're off on your own or like it's like looking at the world from the outside well I've said that before in meditation but it's almost like grasping it, but showing off, or not, sh not showing. It. It's like you're part of it, but you're not. You don't follow. What's accepted, or if you know, it's like you're on a league of your own, kind of. It's like you're everything, but not some, or not controlled by everything. It's like. you're just connected 